Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics and we are going to attack the iter tools module and the method we're going to look at is count and it's it's pretty handy. So all right. From iter tools import count and it's pretty self-explanatory. So let's just look at it. Help count. So all right. It's got a lot of documentation, and I want to see if anybody notices uh, where to go. Um, boom. So that is the tool we're going to use to accompany this. And start and step. So however you want to go through and utilize this, that is it. You give it a starting point and the step. And we know from range, we understand what that means. So all right, let's just let's just build this in. So we do count one and one, and it already defaults to uh, to one. So we could we could literally just do that. So all right, let's look at it. So we got uh, so x equals count. Let's come over here. So, all right, x count one. So then we do next x. We got one. Now check this out. So it'll let you know where where the next one is. So then we do next dot that. Hey, you might say, well, why in the world would we need this? Well, I'll give you a perfect example. You won't have to. You don't have to utilize a for loop. So because once some every once in a while, when you, when you get stuck in a for loop the direction and how about we say you're running down and you want this one thing to happen whenever this is and instead of having to increment or keep up with it you've generated this this object this object and you allow python to do its job and just count and all you do is run your next on x and it keeps account for you. And it's just a wonderful handy tool. You don't have to worry about the direction and jumping out of a loop or breaking or continuing. You don't have to worry about the flow. You let Python do it for you. So all right, real quick video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to click the like and subscribe button and most important, the notification bell. And then my absolute favorite any video requests any comments questions anything you need clarified uh, anything you need more in-depth explaining if I went over something too fast I want you to think about this is your channel help me guide where we need to go I absolutely love uh, all the comments questions really some really good questions that have led me to some pretty cool videos so thanks again for watching we'll see you next time bye guys